This video describes how to process downloads in QQ Catalyst. To access carrier downloads, click on More and then Downloads in the global navigation bar at the top of your screen. QQ Catalyst supports downloads from a variety of sources such as IVINs, TeamUp, and direct downloads from carriers. In order to process IVINs downloads, your system administrator must have set up your IVINs account information and location preferences for each of your locations. In addition, each of your carriers must exist as a carrier contact in QQ Catalyst and must be assigned a valid NAIC code. If your system administrator has set up scheduled downloads, then you will not have to click the download icon to get your downloads as they will be automatically downloaded from your IVANS account. If your system administrator has not set up scheduled downloads, then to process downloads, click on the download icon in the toolbar on the carrier downloads page. You will see a drop down list. If you have more than one location, select the location whose download you want to process and click OK. You may continue working, including going to other parts of QQ Catalyst, while downloads are being processed. However, while QQ Catalyst is processing downloads, make sure to leave your browser window open. When Catalyst finishes processing the downloads, the Carrier Download Summary section updates the status of the downloads. Take a look at the four categories of processed transactions. There are Completed, Need Matching, Print Only, and fail transactions. The completed number is a count of all transactions that have been processed successfully. QQ Catalyst updates policies and contacts when transactions are processed successfully. The need matching number is a count of transactions that will require your attention. Need matching transactions have been downloaded but need to be processed manually because an exact match was not found in QQ Catalyst. The print only number is all the transactions that carriers send in a download that are text files, PDFs, or other types of text documents. In order for a download file to be processed correctly, it must be in AL3 format. AL3 files are electronic data interchange files associated with Accord AL3 standards. Print only files are not AL3 files. Failed transactions are AL3 files sent by the carrier that QQ Catalyst cannot process. There may be errors in the AL3 files or other reasons why QQ Catalyst cannot process the file. Here's an example of an error that will cause a failed transaction. If a carrier sends a download file that has a last name and the birth date field, this will result in a transaction that fails to process because the type of data in the birth date field does not match the type of data that QQ Catalyst expects to see. When you have a transaction that fails to process, contact our product support team. Please note that if you have more than one location, when you select a different location, the numbers in the summary area as well as the data below will change. That is because QQ Catalyst processes downloads and displays results by each location separately. There are more details about transactions below the summary area on the page. Click on Completed to see the transactions that were successfully processed. When you click on the green arrow on the far right, you will get further details about the completed transactions for a particular customer. When you click on Need Matching, you will see a list of transactions grouped by customer name. There can be more than one transaction per customer. If you see in the Carrier NAIC column a numeric code, this means that the carrier has not been set up yet in QQ Catalyst you or your agency administrator will need to add the carrier through new contacts and put in the proper NAIC code. Once the carrier is properly set up as a contact, you can go back and reprocess the transaction and check to see if QQ Catalyst now finds a match. Note that the carrier can send a new policy, an endorsement, a cancellation, and other types of transactions. The number of transactions for a particular customer is shown underneath their name. Click on the green arrow on the far right to see more information about each transaction. When you do so, you will see more detail, including the status which describes which part of the transaction needs matching. There are about eight different statuses that you can be shown here. Here is a description of some of them. Customer not matched. 
the carrier downloads process was unable to find a match for the customer and the location used. The user will be able to create a new customer, search the correct customer, or select the customer from a list of possible matches. Carrier not matched. The carrier does not exist or is not assigned to the location in process. The user must create or add the carrier to the location in order to process the transaction. Policy not matched. The carrier downloads process was unable to find a match for the policy in the location. The user will be able to create a new policy or select the correct one from a list of possible matches. Prior policy not matched. This status applies to renewal transactions and the user can select which of the policies in the suggested list of policies should be used as the prior policy for the renewal transaction. To begin working on resolving the match, click on the customer name. There are workflows associated with each of the statuses to help you resolve the match for each transaction. Once you've completed the workflow and then you reprocess your transaction, QQ Catalyst will move it from need matching to completed. What if you want to remove all the transactions for a particular customer? Click on Remove and these transactions are deleted from QQ Catalyst. However, most of the time you will not want to remove a transaction. The Print Only tab contains documents that cannot be processed. They are text files or other documents that can be attached to a contact for reference. First, save the document to your computer and then attach it to a contact. As mentioned earlier, if you get a failed transaction, contact our product support team. Once you've dealt with transactions that needed matching or a failed transaction, click on the reprocess icon in order to import these transactions into the QQ Catalyst database. When you reprocess your transactions, Catalyst displays a recent activity summary here. If QQ Catalyst had errors while reprocessing, especially problems with your Ivan's account, those would show up here. You can create reports on your transactions. Click on the Print Report icon to open the Carrier Download Transactions Report page. You can show the transactions that were downloaded and ones that were imported. You can get a report on those that were completed, need matching, failed, and those that were just print only. You can define the date range for the report and the locations if you are multi-office as well. Here's what we've described in this video in the Carrier Downloads main screen. How to understand the Carrier Download Summary page. The types of transactions that you will see. Completed, need matching, print only, and failed transactions. How to start the download process. Removing a transaction. Reprocessing transactions and creating reports on transactions downloaded and imported.